chosen ones, empaths. When a narcissist sees you completely restored, this destroys them. They want to come back and finish you off. When they see you're rejuvenated, you're back to your old self, but an enhanced version, a new version 2.0, that's strong again, that's holding their head high, that's over them, possibly in a new relationship, possibly not, doesn't really matter. If they can see that you've recovered and you've made a bounce, you've bounced back from where you was hurt, distraught, you've, you've made a turnaround, you've completely restored. This absolutely furiates the narcissist. They want to come back. When they see you like this, they want to come back. They may be with a new supply, but they want to come back. They don't know how, because the bridge has been burned. They've actually probably been the one that burned the bridge. All we did is just say, I'm not tolerating this no more. There's no way this my life's not a revolving door. You can't get back into my life. Door slam Bolton World did it shut. That's probably what you've done. And you've focused on yourself and your healing. And you've totally improved in every area of life. You've just improved. You're complete completely restored, healthy again. Not destroy, not not eating, not not sleeping. This finishes the narcissist off. They failed. They failed to destroy you. When they left you or discarded you or reverse discarded you, you got too toxic, so you had to cut them off. When they when they was at that place, they thought they were leaving you for dead. They thought they were leaving you finished. They weren't prepared that you was going to actually turn this around. That you was going to become revitalized again, rejuvenated, better. They weren't anticipating that. They never anticipated that. Right? So you've got to understand that this is all the hard work that you've done. All of your energy putting forward, focusing on yourself. Focusing on getting better, focusing on healing. This has destroyed the narcissist. And believe me, they know. They're watching your social media. Or they're stalking you or they're doing something. Finding out from flying monkeys, asking about you, hearing from the, hearing from the flying monkeys that you're doing well. They're pissed. They hate this. They hate to see someone who bounces back, who overcomes everything that they dished out to us because they did put us through some hurt, some pain, some devastating times they put us through, purposely inflicted to destroy, and they failed. That's what we're talking about. They failed to destroy us, okay? They absolutely failed. So you've got to understand that this restoration or being completely restored, this is you now. Never let them back in, you know, because they, they'll make attempts. They'll make attempts to try to get back in your life. They will make attempts. But remember, they're coming back to destroy. They're not coming back to love you. Not coming back to play happy families. They're coming back to finish you off. Right? Because they're tormented. You know? Failing to destroy someone affects their self-esteem. They feel less than. They feel less than you. They always felt less than you, but they feel even lower than you now. Because for a momentary moment, momentary time momentary part of time 
Their head was in the clouds when they discarded you. They felt full of themselves again. When they met this new supply, they were probably even flaunting the new supply at you like, this new supply is great and everything like that. <laughs> but when they see you doing the turnaround, when they see you rising above again, becoming stronger again, getting over them like it's nothing, you know? Because they, 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 they may have not watched you for a little while. And then they've come back and checked on you again. And then they've seen this drastic improvement in the person that they're witnessing. And that's you. You know, drastic improvements. Really turning it around. And if you're not there yet, this is what you need to focus on. If you are not there yet, you know... You've made some adjustments, you're, you are improving, but you don't feel fully restored yet. That's okay, because you're on the pathway to it. You're on the pathway to enlightenment. You're going to become enlightened, right? These people are miserable, miserable savages. They're savages. They are absolute savages. All they wanted to do is see you depressed, hurt, miserable, in pain, hurting, crying, distraught. That's all they wanted from your life. That's why they tried to inflict such damage and they did inflict a lot of damage. But you see when you do this to a chosen one or an empath, yeah, we'll be down for a little while. Yeah, we'll be hurt for a little while. But we bounce back stronger than ever. We turn it around, we become stronger, and they can't take this. The narcissist can't take the fact that you've turned it all around. They just can't take it. They're going to hoover, they're going to reach out, they're going to try to talk to you. You know, it's happened to me, it's happened to me. Seen the signs, I've seen the proof. You know, I've taken this healing journey very seriously, very, very seriously, because I noticed myself nearly fall into new situationships very early on, and I'm glad that I didn't actually proceed with those situationships because they were toxic as well. I didn't stay around long enough to work out if they're a narcissist or a psychopath, but they were toxic as hell. And they had a lot of damage done to them, I think, in the past. So they, 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 there was no hope for them. But trust me, you making this turnaround now, you shining bright again. This is the last thing the narcissist wanted to see. And they are truly, truly pissed about you making this turnaround. So anyway, thank you for watching today. Please press the like and the subscribe button. If you'd like to donate to the channel, you can find a link in the description box. And if you'd like a one-to-one -one session with myself, you can also find a link in the description box. Currently, I've got a secondary channel, a spiritual channel. So anyway, I'll be back with another video soon. Peace.